human beings were always attracted to long distances. We draw them on maps in order to reach them with the objective to shorten them. We sketch waterways, mountains and borders. We achieve on a scale an overall perception of the world and make visible what would be otherwise imperceptible close-up. It is a beautiful feeling, similar to what I experience from here, this privileged viewpoint on Earth, looking even further without prejudice or mistrust. And it's similar to your perspective, one that is at once global and of proximity, one that allows you every day to break down those distances, overcome sketched out borders, look over without fear and reach every corner of the world to be closer, in your case, to those most in need. From up here, in the last few weeks, I have witnessed the magnitude of the hurricanes, even though I did not feel their power. I have seen the estuary of the Betsiboka River in Madagascar, whose appearance continues to change due to the intensive deforestation. It's not easy to distinguish you all one by one in these contexts, but I know you are there and it's as if I am seeing you. I see you in Syria among people afflicted by war. You are in Mexico among those affected by the recent earthquake. You are in Bangladesh, in the Horn of Africa, and next to those who are fleeing wars and persecutions. You are in Europe, in Italy, in every single country on this planet. You are on the streets among people, in ambulances and in hospital wards. It all comes down to points of view and a knack for abstractions. Looking at things from a distance and yet being close by, Keeping in mind the distances that have been drawn, sketched and perceived so far, have actually already been shortened. It's something I'm experiencing from up here in this journey, next to your flag, which I brought with me, which is what makes you recognizable and reliable everywhere you are. You are everywhere for everybody, and now, even a little bit in space with me. Agenzia Spaziale Italiana